Sunday slices. Hey, we're back with Sunday Slices. Last time we sampled uh, Tony Bennett's I Want to Be Around from the 60s. This time I think we're going to go to the 70s and we're going to do Confunction Secrets. Uh, a, I believe it's a funk album, but it should be pretty cool. So 70s, so 70s. This song is called What You Wanna Do, Do What You Wanna Do. It's pretty good. Definitely has got some stuff in it. I don't know if I'm gonna use it yet. I really like the piano part in the background. I think it's really sick. So far, that is my choice, but we will see. Oh. I don't know what that is, but that is the hottest little track on the album. Is that sitar? <laughs> I don't think I've ever heard sitar in a funk band before. That's a contender too. It's got a nice slow tempo. You could do a lot with that. I really don't know how I feel about the sitar, but uh, you know, it's a cool track either way. I got some ideas, but I want to check the other side. Side yet, I'm not feeling anything. The spacers in between these songs are so hard to get to in this this right here. Huh. It's got a lot in it. It's got a lot of fun stuff I can do. So we are going to set up to record. Synthesizers on this track are so cool. All right. I put that baby in machine. Album is called Secrets and the track title is Indian Summer Love. All right, so now we got it back in the machine. And now we can start doing stuff with it. I'm gonna take those individual chords because those are pretty cool. So I'm gonna cut each section of those, especially when it just changes to the new chord. And I'm gonna cut that little synth hit in just for fun. Some stuff to work with. I want to bring the head of each of these times I hit the pad a little bit further forward so that when I hit it, it's got better attack and it, there's no um, latency. So I can. Cool. This kind of has like one shots in it. What I'm gonna do that I did not do last time is this time I'm going to play my drums first. Um, I think that's just gonna give me kind of a better idea and then I can make something cooler out of that. I'm gonna go with a kit that I'm used to using. And just quickly, I'm going to go back over to my sample and then mess with just that beat. And 
for this, I'm just using machine's um, detect sampler mode. Uh, just a cool way just to split it up. They kind of just do it nicely. So I'm going to record some patterns here. See if we can add some more layers. All right, now we are ready for some bass. I'm gonna record a pattern with just bass. One, two, three, four. And yeah, I think that's, you know, kind of where I'm gonna go for this one. I, you know, don't really see a lot more happening in it, but I can, I have at least two parts here. The last thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna just play all the parts of the beat that I took and that I uh, put into it. This is our sample. Kind of basic, I just kind of took some basic rhythms because I thought it'd just be cool. strings other part uh, we worked with a record from the 70s today it was a funk record it had a lot of cool stuff it's always different every sample that you get so you got to kind of work with it and kind of roll with the punches thanks a lot guys have a good week see you next time <laughs>